It's Silly Billy, David K, back with my friends Elroy and Pebbles, who are very crazy today. And we're going to talk about the Jumbo Foam Top Hat. So, we haven't even talked about it! Yeah, that was the first take. This is the second take. Okay, so take a look at the video of me doing this in the show. Let's try the hat. Here we go. Oh, look how handsome. Hello, are you? Oh, good, he's in there. All right, good. All right, so I'll be there. You wear the hat. Now, here's what's going to happen. What's, hello? What's the, oh, the hat is too big? No, I think it's perfect. All right. Oh. All right, is, is it okay now? Yeah, okay, good. So here's what's going to happen. Oh, sorry. All right, we don't need this. All right. So you see, it's very, very funny. Now, a hundred years ago, in the heyday oh of magicians, uh, people in the audience wore top hats, and so did magicians, they wore top hats. And so this gag was very prevalent back then. If you wanted to do the gag a hundred years ago, calm down, calm down, uh, you had to carry around a big, uh, firm hat. But now, you do the same gag, but with a foam top hat. Now, let me borrow one of these. First of all, uh, when you get it, you're gonna steam it out and all the all the wrinkles come out. So it's made of foam, see? Yay! So you squish it into your case and it's and then when you get to the next gig, it's as good as new. Also, uh, because it's made of foam, you can carry your fragile props in it from show to show. So if you have some glass, something glass, or maybe wood, I right, don't pebbles could. <laughs> maybe wood props you don't want to scratch, you carry them in the foam hat. That's a container. When you get to the gig, you do the gag. Now, also, um, the way I use it is, I carry all my loose uh, magic wands and props. Can I hold one? No. Can I hold one? <laughs> no. So you, I carry my loose props in the bag. Uh, this way, when I get to the gig, all the little loose stuff uh, is, is ready for me. I put it out on the table, ready to go. I don't have to go looking for the little wands. Okay. So now one more thing. I want to show you the same gag, but starting differently with the diaper. Take a look. We're going to make him look like a magician. Is the one so, going to break down? No, no. So he's going to put on the magician's hat, okay? All right, here we go. The magician's hat. Oh, look how handsome. He is a magician. Isn't he handsome? Look, what is this thing? He looks a diaper! All right, let's try the hat. Here we go. Oh, look how handsome. It may not be your style, don't do it. I, I, <laughs> you don't have to do it, but if you do it, it's another joke. It's another gag and diapers are very funny. All right, so anyway, Jumbo Foam Top Hat, it's great for the show. I do this in every show when I use the birthday child and I dress him like a magician. So this is a great prop, enjoy it. We'll talk to you next time.